Welcome back, everybody, to Sundrop Square Pants. Welcome to the Mom from the GBA. We're gonna fight some robots, apparently. What a surprise. <laughs> Speaking of surprises, oh look, reused assets from the first run. Um, not quite the first game, but pretty sure this is a reused life cards platform. Maybe it's not from the GB game. Oh, that was very strange looking. From, uh, the Range of Flying Dutchman GB game. Hey, Pat. I can just have my nap with you. Uh, I was, now, see, now I wish I go to Glove World. Yeah, see, I'm pretty sure this boat next to me right here was taken straight from the Range of Flying Dutchman game. And the robots in this game just aren't. Okay, now it's this ledge animation. Why? Just not the same thing as the really fun robots from Battle Key Bottom. So I never like. Whoa. I never like the. Uh, I don't know why. I just never like the general feel of most of the. Ooh, hello. Really good graphics in. Hello. Mm, this thing's gonna be nervous. And we're gonna find Dutchman. Mostly, I'm probably because I just hate the level that they're associated with. Which is why I'm not comfortable seeing those little flying things. Okay. This thing to bounce off of the game. Wonderful. Yes, lots of flashbacks. Oh no! Huh. It's a very different sound effect. Oh no! Dude! They saved me a second chance. It's very nice of them. Oh, no, we need to give someone a second chance to get a light. Now, if they fail that, you can let them not get it. I'm fortunate enough to actually have the mercy of the developers, at least thus far in the game. I think I'm missing out, I admit, by having not done the bonus level so far. Maybe I will end up changing my mind about them, but at least for now, for the first four episodes, I'm not gonna be too serious about that. Second time, the same place. I'm getting a life every single time, too. So it's one of those strange loops. It doesn't actually change anything, you're just wasting time and nothing else. And I'm wasting less and less time each successive run better. It's not better enough to actually survive. Okay, so this time I will jump on here. I get the cry daddy and I will survive. Aha! I can do that a second time right here. Ah, the answer was barely yes. Wonderful. I'm not even gonna bother questioning as to why these cry patties are floating. I do spark. Anchor Toss Competition, uh ho! Oh, that, I'm not gonna talk about that. Well, I saw the Anchor Toss Competition sign up and I saw saying next to it, I figured something else was gonna be going on. Okay. Well, you're only gonna turn up this now? I knew that. I've been using it this whole time. In fact, you were assuming that I knew how to do that in the bonus level. Game, you're a little late on the draw. Come on. Uh. I not like jumping on those things. I don't like jumping in general in this game, honestly. Oh, come on. Sandcastle Contest, I remember that from about pretty clean bottom. So I'm making a very nice sandcastle. Am I gonna go through a giant sandcastle? I'd love it. With Waterloo Rising. Now I must get my hair around. There's a number of little details I remember from that game. Because Astounding, mostly just because I've seen everything just about in that game so many times, literally dozens of times, quite possibly. I've probably heard that line of SpongeBob, Water Level Rising, just get to higher ground dozens of times, and uh, about to mom for a console. Some of all those games I just would love to have eggs used to play more of. Much like I've been doing points too lately. Like I probably should do with Lady at some point. Since I've been enjoying Klonoa so much lately, I'm just about to finish up 
supplemental series with uh, Beach Volleyball. I only have like one or two more recording sessions that I love to do. Whoa! Not gonna get me off guard. That's why I need to do it all. Mostly because I can do that. Hey. I'll take my small victories. Hit! Whoa. I was expecting to actually land on a robot. Alright, wh why am I through like big portals into the Twilight Zone? The same bonus level. At some point, I should actually beat this bonus level. would be a bad idea, I don't think. I wouldn't mind it. So I'd get to see another one, I guess. I would assume. I'm doing better than before. Pressure's on now. Can I get two more patties? However, they're picked up. Yeah! Photo? Yeah, you just get a photo for it. Well, I could say their main surprise not to be the photo. No. But, um, getting to do extra bonus levels afterwards, probably. I would imagine that I'd get a different bonus game afterwards. Just a pick. Yeah, they're all gonna be screenshots from that show, you know that. I I'm kind of nervous to even show them on YouTube because YouTube's not too happy with things from the actual sort of show being shown online. Anyways. Please, please keep me- oh no, it's one mystery. One mystery. I I've noticed that this game is throwing in a lot of game mechanics, which is kind of interesting. No, I, I can try. Oh, it can actually hurt you through mystery, too. Interesting. With that, a new opponent has appeared. See, now that I'm... After my last experience with mystery, I'm really wary of missing Patty, Krabby Patties when I'm riding her now. I'm in condition. It also means I'm gonna pay a lot more attention to all the Krabby Patties around me as well. Aha! We left this giant wall of flowers over the bridge. Don't go down. It's not allowed. I mean, I could get. I'm sure I could ditch mystery down there. Try and stop me. Yeah, I who just leaves a wall of flowers in some place? It's not very considerate. I wasn't trying to land on anything just then, but okay, that works out just fine. Stop that. No, I don't... I'm not playing your games. Bop. Boom. Boom. See, there is... much to be learned from this idea of ditching your... Canyon. Hi. Already done. <laughs> One step ahead of you, Patrick. Yeah, they expect you to do that mystery. That's amazing. Uh, okay. <laughs> I was wondering if I was gonna have to ditch Mystery right then to survive. I'm not quite sure how you just drop Mystery down a pit. Like it could have been. I don't know why. I assume there was ground void for some reason. I don't really know why. Oh, I look like gold state collector. Oh, yeah. Thanks. Yeah, I'm not sure what I was thinking there, though. Stop it.
Um, yeah, so it seemed like a spatula stayed collected, but the Krabby Patties didn't. I know lives don't stay collected, that's interesting. Ah, why, are you guys, why can't you guys be in sync? When you have multiple moving platforms together, especially you have to jump from one to the other, keep them in sync, please. Also, it's really strange that SpongeBob is animated separately from Mystery. <laughs> So one's bobbing up and down, the other isn't. Okay. Bong. I'm not done with mystery yet. Don't make me act like I am. Okay. Come on, please. All I can do is something like, yeah. I can actually just get Mystery up here. Works too. I was thinking I'd just bounce off that enemy and then jump off a of Mystery in midair. I can probably get Mystery over there. I feel like I could. Or oh, maybe not. Oh, yeah, okay. Didn't realize you could jump off the spike enemies. That's usually what. Precisely what you expect enemies to prevent the player from doing. Jumping off of them. Or not really taking into account my past experiences video game. I guess we'll get to find the truth. Uh, at the end of this level, hopefully. Oh no. That, that did not stick much, that's odd. I guess we'll get to find the truth as with regard to whether or not we actually get a new bonus level this time. Um. So what is stopping you from just ditching mystery and dropping you down a hole? I don't think it's been established yet, like why I should not do that. I guess it's just assumed that I'll need her later in the level. Which may prove to be the case, but still. Ah, I need to go off Mystery anyways. Start it. Bye, Mystery. Ooh, yay, we do get a new minigame. Cool. Yeah, I wouldn't mind trying to show all these off. Because they seem kind of interesting. <laughs> Invisible boat would be all wonderful. Oh no, you can see the boat would be all. Okay, so it seems like they're all going to be, like... Actually, remarkably like the uh, SpongeBob expression. It's wonderful. It looks like they're all going to be remarkably like the. Actually, this is basically the exact same thing as the boring levels from the two dimensional Quinella games that I always hated. Losing a life during a boss level is a terrible thing. I want to at least complete it. Oh, I don't actually lose a life. Okay, cool. Ah, why do I have to land something right there? It's a terrible place. <laughs> instead, so in this particular vehicle, instead of inflating myself to float, I just stay afloat by pure force of anger, apparently. He just puts on a really angry looking face and floats for a while. <laughs> It's the only explanation. Yay. That's all I'll go with. That's enough for me. But that will be it for this episode of Let's Say Syndrome Script and Sophie Key Bottom 4 GBA. Apparently, the neighborhood's gonna go somewhere in the next episode. We'll find out what that entails. Not quite sure. Bye, guys.